Uh, Alright, take two. I hope everybody had a uh, beautiful eclipse. It was a wonderful experience for me. I got to drive home just in time for it to get dark, and that was pretty wild. Got out and uh, was able to look up directly at the eclipse at the peak, and no regrets. I hope you enjoyed yours. It was actually a lot of fun. Got caught out in the rain. And, uh, you know, it's been a good day so far. And it's mail day. So, get to show you the purchases for the week. And clearing out the rest of, well, a lot more of my possible reprint uh, blisters. Because we need to get through those before they drop in too much value. Uh, the box itself was way too big to put on camera, so I just opened everything and took it out. I have, sorry, I will say I did look at the red uh, box before opening everything, uh, after I opened everything, but everything else I haven't looked at. I know what's in the tin, it's more blisters, but uh, don't know what's in the black deck box. So we're going to take a look through everything before we open up some uh, some fun, some fun, fun blisters. Starting with us, we got some open packs of sleeves. Always good for shipping. I'm not going to bitch about that. We have, oh, six, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six. 2021 Ten of Ancient Battles. That would be opened at a later date. So we're one, two, three, four, five bursts of destiny. Maze of Millennia, that will be part of today's opening. And should be more bursts of destiny in the tin. You know, probably the best use of a tin I've seen so far. collection of Burst of Destiny already, and this is probably going to double it. Probably one of the next openings is going to be all of my Burst of Destiny. No, you know what? I think I'll hold on to these. I know stuff in the red box is mostly Obelisk and Slifer starter deck stuff, but there's a few other Holographics like Virtual World Hime Nanyan Fusion Deployment. That one's probably going to go into the shop. Cyber Dragon of Hurts. So I have to check the value of that one. I believe there was some more. So I'm pretty sure I saw a Harpy's Feather Duster in here somewhere. Resist Wall, Angel 01, Mary Mary, Mari Mari, and a Harpy's Feather Duster that's probably going in the shop. I believe the rest should be commons. Yep. Now, this one. We haven't looked in this one yet. Alright. I did see an infinite impermanence in there. I'm sure this is going to be mostly commons. Cyberdark stuff. Yeah, this is all the... Uh, this is a whole bunch of... Just starter deck. Oh, we got a rare. Ignite Burst. Oh, I see something down here. Oh. Right, we got a couple of reactor slime and a couple of okay, so it was a couple of slifer decks in here. Littlest angel. Oh, oh, two more herpes feather duster. Nice. 
also going in the shop. Let me make sure to take all of those out. What do we have here? Hey, right, we got a nice infinite permanence also going in the shop. Divine evolution. Okay. Yeah, this is still all of the uh, starter deck cards. Soul Crossing, Cybernetic Horizon. Yeah. Millennium Seeker, Thunder Force, Soul Crossing. Mm hmm. There's our boy Obelisk. Cyber Dark and Dragon, Cyber and Dragon. Yep. And a couple of Cypher decks. That's what I thought. Okay. Alright, so we got two of the most undervalued sets and one of the most overvalued sets this season. Let's uh, see what they can give us before they lose too much value. We got Agnimal Candle, such a cute puppy, Apple Tile Folus, Finis Terre Tower of the Necroworld, Baylance Wave, and Secret right out the gate. Tokusa no Shinkyojin. Alright, so we're going to start with a secret. Good sign, good sign. We got Gaia Blaze, the Force of the Sun, Behemoth King, Super Heavy Samurai Security, Evil Tile, and an Ultra Noble Arms Museum. Man, all right, Duelist Nexus really showing up from the, right out the gate. Grinosaurus Giga Cannon, Jurassic Power, Million Century Ice Prison, Valence Wave, Infernoble Knight Turpin for the Super. Agnimal Candle, Rescue Ace Preventer, Signs of the Testina, Daidara Bauchi, Gazelle King of the Mythical Claws. Pretty, pretty boy. And, uh, looks like a little friendly there, don't they? I hope you pulled out your popcorn, got something to drink, ready to hang out for a minute. Because uh, we're going to be here for a second opening up packs, getting some beautiful cards. If you're looking for anything, remember I do have a shop on TCG Player. Link down in the description. And probably right over my head at some point in time during this. Another turban. And remember, we are on the road to 500, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. So please go down there, hit the subscribe button, and let me know. What was your favorite card today? We have the capability of pulling a lot of really good stuff today. Venus, Synchro World, Signs of the Testina, Early Shirley, and another Turpin. But, you know, not if we keep pulling shit like Turpin. Thank hey, good lord. Unchained Soul. Come on, secrets. We want secrets, we want starlights, we want QCRs. Collector's rares, Gaia Blaze, Behemoth the King, Super Heavy Samurai, Evil Tile Folus, and Unchained Lord, uh, Soul Lord of Yama. That's a good, that's another good one. All right. We got one secret, two ultras, we got Stardust Worm. Alright, Unchained. Apparently Unchained's doing pretty good in the markets right now, so... Probably another one that's going in the shop. Another beautiful behemoth over here. Baylance Wave. 
Unchained Soul of Shabara, Wheel Synchron, and Ursatron Alpha. Super Heavy Samurai, Behemoth the King, Agnimal Candle, oh, well you know what, straight to another Ultra Fusion Armament. Yo, anything Ultra and up, I will definitely take. Probably another one for the shop. Did you guys get any good uh, views, pictures, videos of the... Uh, Eclipse? Let me know. Beta Evolution Pool. Magic Deity. Wheel of Synchron. Conco Spirit Walk. And Duelist Genesis. Pretty. But probably not worth a whole lot. Five packs of Duelist Nexus left. We got Finnis Ture, Tower of the Necro World, Beta Evolution Pill, Magic Deity, Wheel Synchron, and Hound of the Tistina. Also very pretty. Tistina cards are actually really, really nice, but they don't do a whole lot. Field Coatl, Gaia Blaze, the Force of the Sun, Evil Sor Leos, Behemoth the King, and Sentinel of the Testina. See, see those Testina cards, they're so pretty. Great foiling, but they don't do a damn thing. Synchro World, Pearly Shirley, Bullheaded uh, Dino King Rex, Signs of the Testina, and Manadium Torrid. Manadium, Manadium, however you want to pronounce that. Magic Deity again. Another Wheeled Synchron. Mechanko Fire uh, Spirit Walk. Evil Sor Leos. And you're finished. I believe the next two are collector sets. So, we'll see what we get out of those. New World Formation. Evil Soil Leos. Jurassic Power. Split Mirror of the Underworld. Ultimate Bright Knight. Ursatron Alpha. I don't know if you guys saw or not. But Branded in Japan is getting a whole collection. Alternate arts. All kinds of stuff. Yo, if you're Japan, if you're in Japan and want to hook a homie up, I want that branded set. All right, pre-preparation frights, super soaring, confiras de novelas, and a bunch of rares that nobody cares about. Quick little cleanup. Look, we don't get any high rarities out of this, I'm talking like QCRs or collectors or something like that, then I might just go get some Valiant Smashers and continue until we get something really good. Vanquish Soul, Calamity Caesar, Fire Formation Tinky, Vanquish Soul Pluton HG, Enemy Controller to take your girl. Moan heat wave. And not what we do here in Texas. We got 
Giant Rex. Incantation Bookstone. Xeno Meteorus. I need to check on his value. He was getting close to a dollar. And a bunch of bullshit. Man, outside of that Tokusano, I don't know. It's not looking good so far, guys. Might have to go get some more packs. Double Evolution Bill. Frostosaurus. Balamunier de Novellus. Ultimate Conductor Tyranno and a bunch of BS. Well, I mean, Eradicator Epidemic is a fun card. I'm going to say it's a good card. It's a fun card. Alright, we got Vanquish, Vanquish, Soul Calamity, Caesar again. Incantation, Bookstone, Deck Devastation, Virus, another fun, but not necessarily good. Definitely fun. And what do we have here? Okay, we have an Ultra Rare Stake Your Soul on the last pack of the Wild Survivors. Hey, at least it gave us one Ultra. I can't, can't be too upset about that. All right, Maze. Can you do any better? We got Alter Geist Prime Banshee, D Synchro, Salamander the Flying Flame Dragon. Mm -hmm. We got Doppel Warrior, Combat Wheel, Earthbound Servant Geo Griffin. Bonfire. That would be nice. Minimum. Flame Sword Stance. Totem Pole. Ultimate Flame Swordsman. Well, he's an OG and a homie. Not who we are looking for today. We got a horn source. Earthbound prisoner groundkeeper. Earthbound prisoner stone sweeper. In the shop you go, brother. Got Mirage Swordsman, Hornsaurus, and Phoenix Gearblade. D Synchro, Doppel Warrior, Synchro Chase, and do we have something here? Fighting Flame Dragon and. Hotel and Delta Wing. <laughs> of all the ultras that it could give us, Hotel and Delta Wing. Alter Geist Prime Banshee. Flame Swords Dance. And another Stone Sweeper. Supreme King Dragon Dark Worm, Broad Swordsman, Magispector Raccoon Bunbuku. Alright, this one is going to decide whether or not we go grab some more packs or not. I am not seeing anything I want today. Mm -mm -mm. Orange Source. Altergeist and Chlorless. You know what? We get some guaranteed secrets out of this, and some that I'm actually kind of looking for, wanting just a couple. 
So you know what? Let's see if we can pull some good staples. And I don't have to break into my blisters. All right, we got AIQ, Adoyan, Adagnister, Awakening the Possessed, Raid Raptor, Phantom Knight's Claw, Soldier Gaia, the Fierce Knight, Speed Droid, Bro Block and Roll, Phantom Knights of the Stained Greaves for the Super, Artillery Catapult Turtle, and Dogmatica, Ecclesia, the Virtuous for the Prismatic Secret Rare. Golly, that's pretty. And then we got Gizmic, Kaku the Supreme Sh Shining Sky Stag. Wow. And there's one I was looking for. Divine Arsenal, Double A Zeus, Sky Thunder. I've opened quite a few of these, and I've never pulled a Zeus out of either set that he was he was a part of. Automatically, a win. I will, I will take that one. Yo, can we keep that up? Can we get more than one Zeus in this opening? That would be hilarious. Out of all the packs that I've opened of this, and I buy some random packs, not in a tin. And I get Zeus. Ugh. In for Noble Knight Captain Oliver. Proxy F Magician. Ret Time Reviver Remitter. Emitter. Kusari. Deep Sea Mistral. Minstrel. Ad Emancipator. Chaos Summoning Beast. Deep Sea Aria. I need to check the price on that one. And we got a Sky Striker Ace Rose. And her Ultra Risha Doll Windy and True Light Reader's Night and then a lot of BS. Was Ash Blossom and I believe Dragoon was in here. I'd really like to get a, a Dark Dragoon. Magical Broker. Awakening of the Possessed, Curse of the Dragon, Obsessive Uvulip, Lord Nergal, Feedran, Artillery Catapult, Infernoble Arms, and Parallel Exceed. Probably another one that's going to be in my shop. And a Midorned Archosaur. Hey. I think that one might be okay. might be all right. And another true light. All right, we got Infra Noble Knight Oliver, Melfi Caddy, Doyan, Melfi Hide and Seek, TAI Strike. Elfie Puppy, Fiendish Portrait, Drytron Beta Restabon, and Tri Brigade Ferrisheet, the Baron Blossom. Gizmic. <laughs> and a second Zeus? Really? I know I got two of these bad boys. All right. Hey, totally worth grabbing these bad boys. Okay, all right. The funny thing is, I just wanted to pull them. They're actually probably still going to wind up in my shop. I have no use for them in my branded deck. Probably never going to build a deck that I would ever use them in. Well, maybe. So, uh, I'm just happy that I pulled them. Uh, probably be in the shop later. Melcat, Infernoble Knight Oliver, Lantern Shark, Melfi Hide and Seek, Awakening of the Possessed, Ice Dice, Link Rebo, probably another one that's going to wind up in my shop, Super Heavy Samurai Scarecrow, that one also, 
in virtual world Roshi Lao Lao. Probably not going in the shot. Chaos Ruler, the Chaotic Magical Dragon. Ooh, he's pretty. And I was hoping for one more Zeus, but not out of this pack. Alright. Can we get a third Zeus? Just Can we get a playset just for shits and giggles? Wouldn't that be hilarious? Randa Bozu. And for Noble Knight. Melfi Caddy. Talker Inverted, Goki the Power Lord Ogre, Torpedo Takedown, Virtual World QB Shenshin, Gravity Controller, El Shadal Epcolon, Virtual World Zehi, Zeji, and Adamancer Peter Risen Dragite. <laughs> was not expecting these but I'm so happy I pulled them alright alright guys if you've made it this far, go down in the comments and just put in the word Zeus. And I will see you guys soon. <laughs>